It's part choreographed dance and part acrobatics. Figure skating is a fan favorite in the Winter Olympics. I think it's a sport that offers excitement, discipline, uh, it's very free, very exciting, and brings in the arts as well. Push, 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 push. Good job. Pauline Gasparini has coached in three different Winter Olympics. Just the whole demeanor of the Olympics, it's, it's very exciting. And for the past 24 years, she's been coaching here at the Tampa Bay Skating Academy in Oldsmar. Let's take one more and see if you can try and go down a little bit more. Tighter on the legs, okay? Ice is ice. I mean, you have talent in Florida. Skaters going to the Olympics, you have talent in Alaska. It's just the athlete's dedication and having a coach who can get you there. Now, no level of coaching will ever get me to the Olympics, but Oldsmar Skating School Director, Diane Paul, is going to do her absolute best to turn me into a figure skater. Now, I have played ice hockey my entire life. But I have never once figure skated, so this should be interesting. Figure skates are completely different than hockey skates. The boot has a heel, the blade is more flat, and there's this little thing called a toe pick. Uh, yeah, I had to get someone to tie my skates. <laughs> this is a little embarrassing. These subtle differences can make skating very difficult. Now, if you're gonna be a figure skater, you gotta get those arms out. There you go. So we started with the basics. Yeah. Bend the knees a little bit. And worked our way up yeah. from there. So it's lean forward, bump, bump. No, didn't, didn't my butt now. You got your baseball bat in this hand. Bend our knees a little bit. We're gonna hit a home run. And after 30 whole minutes of intense training, we put together this gold medal worthy performance. Oh my goodness. A little dizzy. That was phenomenal. We did it. <laughs>